This is Purin, a heavy drone from Russia, earlier the drone video was released where it was in testing phase, now the drone can be seen with Russian forces. The UAV is capable of transporting a soldier to the front line, and similarly a wounded soldier back. It is also capable of transporting supplies to the soldiers fighting and holding positions in the trenches. The drone also showcases an important capability which never tested before, this drone fire a guided anti-tank missile both while hovering and on the surface. Faggot anti-tank missile was tested with this drone, which has a firing range of 2.5 kilometers when fired from land, from the air its range will be more. Another important capability this drone offers is reconnaissance, with more weight carrying ability it can be equipped with variety of sensors, including thermal imaging sites, laser rangefinder and laser designator. There are also plans to integrate a machine gun, an unguided rocket system like the one on gunships. The loading capacity of Purin drone is 200 kilograms, in this range this drone can be tailored for multiple mission requirements. The drone is the heaviest of its kind in service with four electric motors and two battery sets. This drone is good while in the testing phase and it is fulfilling all the roles, but in the real warfare. Where Russian army is using FPV drones to destroy the larger Ukrainian hexacopters, and similarly the Ukrainian forces are using the FPV drones to target the Orlan 10 recon UAVs, will this heavy drone of Russia will survive? Its larger size is negative point which makes it easy to spot and target, one FPV drone hit and the whole system will be on the ground. It also depends on the altitudes at which the drone will operate. Although the exact specifications have not been released, if the UAV flies at high altitudes to evade loitering munitions, it may become a target for air defense systems. This is why the drone needs to fly low and operate swiftly to maintain its safety and effectiveness.